Public Entertainment и Беста и Любе. Основана на бестселлере Кена Фолета. Англия, 1136. Время войны и страданий. Ну и с пепла возродится год. Толпы земли. Интерактивный роман и новая игра от Daedalic Entertainment. Короче, народ, у меня опять выбился стрим, и вот с этого момента, короче, пошло все по жопе. Мне пришлось перезапускать ОБС, чтобы снова поиграть. Ладно, короче, продолжаем. Тут чуть-чуть уже осталось пройти первую главу. Так, по-моему, вот не помню в прошлый раз. Да. В прошлый раз я просто рыцарям давал курятину, чтобы это... Так. Сказать тому что? Did you know there's a princess living here? Well, I heard the Earl has a daughter, but that's about it. Uh -huh. Так, хорошо. Что нам надо дальше сделать? А, Альфред считает, точно так, сейчас. Я уже забыл. Стоп. Did you know there's a princess living here? Well, I heard the Earl has a daughter, but that's about it. Подожди, а почему? Короче, по поводу Альфреда, а, в прошлый раз, видимо, то ли это пройдено, короче, мы говорим о том, что сын считает, что отцу пофиг на него, вот. Так, ладно, так, подожди. А что дальше делать? А, подожди. Мы даже что еще с этим не говорили, что ли, с чуваком? Подожди. А, а почему? Очень странно. Блин, капец, он еще спускаться будет до фигища. Там. 
бам 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 Просто прикол в том, что... А, когда это... Сбивается стрим, это дико бесит. Так, вернуться назад. С Альфредом можно поговорить? Чувак. В смысле? А, про принцессу сказать этой девке. Все, вспомнил. Все, я вспомнил на каком моменте. Смотрим, короче. Значит, это Алиенна. Yes, Алиенна. Your father let you renounce a wedding. I'm sure he wouldn't mind if you declined this as well. <laughs> What a cheerful little girl. And an annoying boy. We will get along. You may bring them up. No. Oh, it's you. I noticed you and your parents from my window. What can I do for you? Um... You're quite shy, aren't you? Would you like something to eat? But they won't serve food yet. They do what I tell them. I will have Matthew get you some bread. Yes, please. Where's your mother? <coughs> my mother died. Aren't you sad? I was. But that was a long time ago. My brother Richard can't even remember her. My mother's dead too. <laughs> When did she die? Last week. Oh. Who's that woman with you then? That's Ellen. She's Jack's mother. And where's your father, Jack? He doesn't have one. Well, everyone's got a father. Did he die too? Так, промолчать. Did he run off? Some men are such beasts. А ну он промолчит. Come on, I want to show you something. Покажи. been up this high before no wow all the people look so small like little mice you must be up here every day I used to but nowadays I try to hold myself back why we are about to make some great enemies if our first assault fails I may want to lay siege to our castle, so I will have to get used to staying up here for a long while. I suppose this view will bore me soon enough. Till then, yeah, I'm trying to keep it special. And you're sharing it with us. I don't think that I'll ever get bored by this. Come on, let's go back down. Matthew will take you to your parents. Okay. How did it go? Oh, she was so pretty. Don't you agree, Jack? Hmm. Так, сохранение было. Так, ей. А ну, подожди. The Lady Aliena thinks there will be an attack. Here, go find Tom and tell him. На это мы, мы это мы это знаем, да. Текс, курочку Альфреду.
Where did you get that? Mm. Just eat it. Ha! I can see we're going to be good friends. Так, идем теперь к дому. Что-то я Дэвида Боуи вспомнил, ну да ладно. Так. Том. Леди Алиена is expecting an attack. An attack? So the Earl is planning to go to battle. That's very helpful, Jack. Now, why don't you help me find some damage to the castle? The Earl might not want to fight if his defenses are in bad shape. Thanks. Ah, по поводу принцессы мы уже это уточнили, да? What is it, boy? You can build castles? Oh, if I have the money, yeah. Maybe one day I'll show you how. Mm. Okay. What do you need work? No, it's понятно, это логично, да. Not everyone can live in a forest, boy. No. No. People need to be around people. Like the laws in town, uh -huh. rents, or wages. If everyone did whatever they liked, things would get very bad. Так. They refused you. Just because work really falls into one's lap, that doesn't mean there is none. I'll give this place a look over while you tell your mother to be paid. What are you looking for? Something to convince the Earl that keeping things the way they are won't do for No, it's понятно, да, это мы уже поняли. Could be something small, like washed out uh -huh. water. Yeah, I need to see the hole before I can carve the rock. Okay. Ну, наконец-то можно что-то досмотреть. Так, отлично, стена. Потом здесь зубцы. И последняя будет колодец. Иди сюда, ёпарасоте. Так. Колодец. Jack, be careful. Don't get too close. Так, отлично. Теперь надо всех убедить в том, что все типа сломано. Как-то так. The battlements are broken. I noticed that already. Anything else? There is a wall without water. If that's true, you have a very keen eye. And the well is in bad repair. It is? Hmm, very good, Jack. That is one thing the Earl needs to get fixed for sure. Well, I should do for now. Yeah, stay sharp. You did a very good job, son. Now, come along. You deserve to see if it works. Look, I'd like to give you work, but we don't need you. I just hope you're not expecting a siege soon. Why do you say that? Your defenses are in bad repair. Be specific, man. 
the mortar in your walls has come away in places. This leaves an opening for a crowbar, and once there's a hole, it's easy to pull the entire wall down. Anything else? Yeah. The keep has an undercroft with a wooden door. If I were attacking the keep, I'd go through that door and start a fire in the stores. And if you were the Earl, how would you prevent it? I'd have a pile of stone ready shaped and a supply of sand and lime for mortar. And a mason standing by ready to block up that doorway in times of danger. Matthew, may I have a word? Well, we have a home for now. Is that all right for you all? Of course. Alfred? Why are you asking me? Because you're a builder. I think you have a say in it too. It's fine with me. Grab your things, everyone, and follow me. It's time we put a roof over our heads. And thus, Tom Builder had finally found work. <clears throat> we know then that it wouldn't last for long. Да, вот, короче, как-то так. Это глава. Глава четвертая. Приор. Приор, короче, за священника играть. It's good you sent your brother to tell your flock in St. John's about your nomination. If you've gone yourself, they might not have let you leave again. There is a good chance I will return to St. John's after the election today. Why so pessimistic? Many of the brothers still want Remigius to become prior. Philip. Yes? There was an incident with one of our novices. Mm -hmm. What kind of incident? Remigius came to him. He was bleeding all over. He could barely walk, but walk he did. Called out for him, but he did not turn around. He never looked back. He ran away. He was not the first. And it wasn't the first time Brother Marcus was punished either. Brother Marcus? Yes. He stole my keys. And food. You reported him to the Regis. He did. But he was practically a child. Regis really goes too far. Last year he hit a novice. The poor soul became deaf in one ear. <sighs> Tell me, Philip, what will be the first thing that you do when you're elected? Так, с долгами решимся с церкви, да? We must become self-sufficient and pay off our debts. Oh, no. Yes, we must. It will take years of hard work. You just keep doing what you have always done, Milius. And we will teach the brothers out there to do the same. You cannot go in there. What was that? Who are these people? Hey! Step back! Step back, I said! What is going on out there? Soldiers? Did they start a war again? Those fools! Philip! It's Francis! They have Francis! Francis? Вот, короче, Фрэнсиса схватили. Это, видимо, когда мы то ли епископу, что ли, сказали про это письмо. 
А он, наверное, не поверил. И кто послал этих стражников, хрен его знает. Но интересно. В общем, дорогие друзья, спасибо, что смотрели. Ставили лайки, приглашали друзей. Не забывайте про колокольчик. Игрушка очень интересная. Это был первый стрим. Так что с вами был Казуку Фэмили. Всем до новых встреч. Увидимся на следующем стриме. Будем проходить много что интересного. А всем удачи. И всем до новых встреч. Пока-пока. Ну что ж, здравствуйте, дорогие друзья, с вами вновь Казуку Фэмили. И моей целью является пройти первую книгу Столпы Земли, их три. И мне интересно, чем закончится первая книга. Мы остановились в прошлый раз, что схватили Фрэнсиса. Так что всем приятного просмотра, делайте чаечек, кофеечек. А мы погнали! Дальше играть в эту интереснейшую игру. Так. С рыцарями что ли поговорить? What is happening here? Return to your brothers, monk. We'll question you soon enough. Stop. I need to unload my inventory. Wait a minute. They said they're looking for someone. They were questioning some of our brothers. Okay. What is happening here? Return to your brothers, monk. We'll question you soon enough. Этих что ли поспрашивать монахов что ли? I'm afraid these soldiers are looking for your brother. He has just arrived. Two of them followed him into the cloister. No, no. Uh huh. Погнали. Опана. What's your name? It would be easier for us all if you just came with us. <laughs> what about the child? Is it yours? <laughs> Francis. Like it or not, you'll be coming with us. We were looking for you. What are you doing here? And who is... Who is that? I found him. In the woods. Hey! Hey! We fed him goat's milk and St. John's. Johnny ate them still. Mm -hmm. He says he misses you. He was always very sentimental. Hey! Philip, you must not tell these men my name. My Lord Robert of Gloucester believes me to be in Winchester. Gave the letter to the bishop. He said he'd help. May God have mercy on us. 
Тублетки. А ней, по полту не найдешь. Come on, you two. Thou shalt not take the name of the Lord thy God in vain. What? One of the ten commandments. Do you not know them? Now save your words, monk. Do you not know of heaven and hell? I do. I know of them. I know of heaven and hell. If you know and still go against the word of God, you will not be saved. Not heaven awaits sinners, but hell, the lake of fire. We'll take hell then. No. No. William. What is your name, monk? I am Philip. Philip of Gwyneth. It's him we're looking for, not the other one. Monks, they all look alike. We were looking for you. Bishop Whaler Run wants to see you. Oh. We found him. He's here. Tell the bishop. I found the monk. The bishop. Tell the bishop. Go on, monk. We'll all keep an eye on you. You will be safe. <laughs> Так, и что нам делать? What is going on here, Philip? I... I don't know. Philip McQuinnett! The bishop knows he's here, we told him. He's expecting you. Офигеть. Вот это замута, ребят. Philip. There you are. The right Reverend Bishop Wayne and Bio. Philip and I are already acquainted. You were looking for me, my bishop? <coughs> I was. Remigious, Philip does look distressed, does he not? Yes, he does. Tell me, what is on sure. your mind? Soldiers have invaded the Priory. Invaded? Oh, of course. I have gotten too used to the presence of knights and nobles. The work of the bishop. The reason why these men are outside right now is your letter, Philip. <sighs> As I suspected, it did convince my allies to go against the Earl of Shire. These allies of mine insisted that their knights should accompany me along with their son. And very soon, they will ride against the Earl. I understand, my bishop. Philip, I have the feeling that there is a storm rising. No. Right here, in Kingsbridge. And in the eye of that storm stands one man. Around you, things... things begin... Sure. Don't they, Remigius? Yes. But there is one important thing you have kept for me. 
there is my bishop. You did not mention that you were nominated to be prior of Kingsbridge. I... The brothers here will elect their new prior today, will they not? The election will take place in a few hours, my bishop. We need a strong prior. James was my friend. Ага, вот оно что. We are in agreement on these matters, are we not? Of course, right, Reverend. The bishop and I agreed you should have this. Okay. Very well. Now, when your distinguished guests arrive. What will be the subject of your first sermon as the new prior of Kingsbridge? Hmm. I think what I would talk about is... I beg your forgiveness. But I do not understand. Most of your brothers agree with me on this matter. Remigius has talked to them. They will vote for me. As will I. And I will support you in your duties in my role as sub prior. A role you have fulfilled wonderfully in the past, Remigius. Wonderfully. My bishop? Philip of Gwynedd. You will be the new prior of Kingsbridge. Uh, in humbleness, I stand before you, most humbled by your trust and humbled by the great tasks ahead of us. We must restore Kingsbridge to do justice to the glory of God and to his mercy. The desperate and the hopeless everywhere shall hear our bells. They shall see our towering cathedral. Our great church will become a guiding light the first and foremost. Through our actions and our faith, we ourselves shall be situated. A light to the lost, the hurt, and the suffering on their path to war. The Earl of Shiring is not in attendance, it seems. He is not. Shameful. He's busy preparing his siege of Winchester. Uh -huh. I trust he does not know we are about to foil his plans, Percy. Answer the bishop, my husband. No, no, he does not expect us, not at all. My men are ready. So is our son. Excellent. <laughs> Excellent. There you are. What's the matter? What happened to my father? Did I have one? Yes. Everyone has a father. Hmm. What happened to him? He died before you were born. How could he be my father? If he died before I was born? Babies grow from a seed. The seed comes out of a man's prick and is planted in a woman's cunning. Then the seed grows into a baby in her belly, and when it's ready, it comes out. Is Tom gonna plant a seed in you? Maybe. Then you will have a new baby? A brother for you. Would you like that? I don't care. Tom's taking you away from me already. A brother wouldn't make a difference. Nobody will ever take me away from you. Huh. What was my father's name? Jack. The same as you. They called him Jack Sherberg. So, if there's another Jack, I can tell people that I'm Jack Jackson? <laughs> you can. People don't always call you what you want them to, but you can try. What is that? Jack, find the others. They're tired and don't come out till I tell you.
Охренеть, сейчас жопа начнется. Офигеть. Вот это поворот. Вот это жесть. Веселые события ждут сейчас нас. Ничего не скажешь, не поспоришь. Глава пятая. Человек, объятый пламенем. Офигеть. It is all right, Brother Paul. I told them that there's a toll. Who is your leader? Who will speak for you? No one will speak for us, monk. We were chased from every village. They are outlaws. We are no outlaws. <laughs> We come from Earl's castle. They killed our men! My child! They killed my child! My God. We cannot feed you. We barely have enough for ourselves. We will give them shelter. Philip, we have not enough room. We will give you all shelter. All of you. I wish I had more to give. More? We've given away almost all the food we have. What will these poor people eat tomorrow? Before they came here, they fed themselves. They worked. Surely they could do that again. <sighs> there are more coming. Word is spreading fast. What do we do now, Philip? Give me the rest of the bread. But... Окей. Then help to clean out the empty houses and tend to the injured. You heard our prior, brothers. Так. Детям без родителей, а где они? Вот. Children, take some food. Please, take it. You have to eat. Here, I will put it here. Eat when you are hungry. No. Take some bread for your children. This is not enough. He has more bread. I saw it. Please, our children are starving. Give us bread for our children.
Так. Угу. Подожди. Группа беженцев. Подожди, а где? Не могу понять, группа беженцев, это понятно. Беженцы у мельницы. А, вот. Весело. Филип, мы running out of room. Have you done as I told you? We have cleared out the houses and put up fires. All houses are occupied, and our brothers are treating the sick and injured. There is still some room in the guest house and in the dormitory. Tomorrow we will open the cathedral. We need all the room we can get. Prior Philip. Yes? I am Tom, master builder. And I'd like to rebuild your northwest tower. Dear God, you look even worse than the others. Like they haven't eaten in days. They just don't stop coming, do they? I have worked on Salisbury Cathedral. My last employer was the Earl of Shiring himself. I know my craft. If you let your tower collapse, it may tear down parts of the nave. Hire me, and I'll make it strong again. I wish I could hire you. Repairs would cost much, and we have nothing. That child? You are raising a child? My brother found Jonathan in the woods and brought him here. The poor boy would have frozen to death if it hadn't been for God's great mercy. Jonathan. Look, I am sorry, but all I can offer you is a place to sleep. I'll accept it, but I'd rather earn it. We didn't come here to beg. Ask God, then. That wouldn't be begging, it'd be prayer. You remember what I told you about the kindness of monks? Ask God. That wouldn't be begging, it would be prayer. <laughs> oh, I will pray. I will pray for a thunderbolt to strike the church and level it to the ground. I wonder if they refused us because of me. Can't we go home? Not anymore. We used all our supplies on the journey here. We've made our decision. Now we need to see it through. Can I look around a bit? Yes, but don't stroll too far. Be cautious of those monks. I told you the baby would be safe. What baby? Monks may be whips, but they take care of their own. He will grow up to be a monk. He will. There are worse things than going up close to God. Mm. Jonathan. That's the name they've given him. A gift from God. Jonathan. I wish I could help you. I know. But you have to be careful. You must never know that you're his father. Tom? Fine. Stupid. Huh. <laughs> huh. 
Да, жизнь за... Но это понятно, это повторяется. Так. Yes. Oh, hello. Ah, I'm afraid we are out of food. Who is it? The mason's boy. I'm sorry, but I cannot help you. Come back in the morning, will you? Oh, poor soul. Hardly sleep. At least they don't have to take care of a baby. Okay. Так. Ага. Делаем, наверное, два сохранения тут. И... Ладно, и тут тогда. Not a ghost, little redhead, even if I am at death's door. If you go first, I will put you in the ground. It's what I do. I'll make it a nice grave. You'll like it, but you must dig me one, too, when my time comes. Agreed? That's good. Good. You must not be afraid to die. Death is not the end. There is more after. That's the secret. That is what all this here is about. You see? Uh-huh. Это 
dans ce manard, enfin, voilà. Il y a ce face moi bien. Ah, who are you? Ah, you're one of the refugees from Ellis Castle, aren't you? Did you see how they killed people? I don't think I could take it. We monks do not do things like killing. Maybe it was Brother Marcus, stealing food. No, after that beating he would never come back. What if it is Brother? James is dead, he's still in the river. We couldn't put him to rest. Could that be? Philip said Prior James did not commit suicide. So it couldn't have been. And then what did I see? I saw something. <laughs> There are things deep in the woods, in the streams, the rocks. Many farmers give them offerings. They shouldn't do that. They must be demons. An angel would not hide in the forest. Just so. I will not change my mind on this matter. We will help them, all of them. Remigius, do you truly want to leave these people to die? Mm -hmm. We should remove ourselves from the world, my prior. It is for God to decide, not us. We will help these people. We must. Uh -huh. Hey, what are you doing here? Remigius here is right. This is no place for children. Now I remember her. What is it now, Remigius? This woman, she came with the builder. Yes? She is not a refugee. What do you mean? She's an outlaw. She's been here in the past. Prior James warned me about her. She is not from Earl's castle. She's from the forest. But her husband? I doubt they are married. Young man? Are you not the Builder's son? What's your name? Uh... Sure. Jack Jackson. Son of Jack. Well then, you may go now. He is not the builder's son. I, I knew it. He is her son. And of a man called Jack. Fornicators, that's what they are. Unmarried, even. That huh. woman must be expelled from Kingsbridge. I have no idea. I will think about it. Понял.
wish someone would just tear that cathedral down so we could start afresh. That would require a miracle, and I really don't know a thing about them. I'm so tired. Come, I'll sing you a lullaby. Actually, it's Jack's favorite. A lock caught in the hunter's net Sang sweeter then than ever As if the falling melody Might wing and net dissever at dusk the hunter took his prey, the law is freedom never. All birds and men are sure to die, but songs may live forever. Bottom bum takes. Mm -hmm. Chasha Switch up. Зажигаем. Тикс. Так, и набираем воды. Текс. Стоп, подожди. Мама, тогда сможем пройти или нет? Закрыто. very dry. Uh-huh. 
ducks. Так, сохранимся. Что, так что ли сделать? Так, ну это было нужно было для достижения. Так, загрузиться. X. Делаем так. If they need to build a new cathedral, Tom will get work, and we can stay here. Tom always talks about wanting to work on the cathedral. Valium. 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 No. <coughs> There's a breeze coming from the back. Them we must repent. 
for what we did to you. To all of them. For my sins. Cast me into the lake of fire. Письмо написать. Так, сам. My dear brother. Only two days have passed since you left our priory. Mm -hmm. Much has happened in these two days. Many desperate men, women, and children have found refuge here. The Earl of Shire was arrested. His castle taken by my bishop's ally. The people that we shelter were driven from that castle. Francis, I know this was not your fault, but I, myself, cannot but feel responsible for their fate. A couple has come to seek shelter at our priory. Remigius tells me the woman is a witch. Even if that is not true, they seem to live in sin. Mm -hmm. Remigius said to expel them from their act against God. But I decided against it. They might speak their vows as soon as opportunity is offered. Thanks. Milius and Cuthbert had taken it upon themselves to feed the baby. They called it Jonathan, the gift of God. Johnny Eightpence was right. He loves goat milk. The gift of God. And yet someone gave up on him. I will not give up on him. Or on anyone else. Игра прям как фильм. Круто, очень. Not on us either. Even if the hope for my own redemption is as small and frail as Jonathan is. Tax. I pray that this letter finds you in good health. In consideration of my own, I ask that you not talk about our parents again. One must let these things rest. I've made my peace mm -hmm. and won't hear any more of it. I heard from you that only three in Earl Robert's employ can read. One of them is my brother. Your brother, Philip. that save yourselves the saints we must save the saints my god my god don't go in there but for the office the, the saints we must save him no no don't go <laughs> Жесть. While the monks and refugees cleaned up, I kept hidden. I hadn't expected that a magnificent building like this could so utterly collapse. That the ignorant little boy that I had been could so easily turn it back into a pile of dirty stones. 
I knew then that I had done something wrong. And no one could ever find out. Prior Philip, I uh, had the site cleared. It should be safe now. Good work. Thank you, Master Builder. This concludes a very long night. Many people left already. They asked me to thank you for your kindness. They're sorry for what happened. Well, they should thank God for his mercy. No one got hurt, no one died. Forty-five monks and eleven novices, all accounted for. No one's missing. No one? Milius and Cuthbert even saved our saint from the crypt. Do you know what caused this? Someone set fire to the roof. Do you suspect anyone? No. The church was empty when we locked the doors. Oh, no one got hurt. The books were saved. Even the bones of your saint were unharmed. Maybe this happened for a reason. What do you mean? Here. Let me show you something. Sorry about what happened to your church, but you must remain steadfast. <laughs> no, no, you're only seeing the sunrise because you're facing east, straight east, like a church. Now, I know you have no money, and the helping people is more important, but we could start right here. Take the stones we've got, and the people we want to help. So, what is it I am looking at, Tom Builder? the aisle of your new cathedral. I see it. I see now. Да, глава 5 выполнена. Вот. Неплохо. Так. Винчестер. A few weeks later, I received an invitation from Bishop Waleran. In Winchester, we and Waleran's allies were to meet King Stephen himself. The bishop seemed assured that, because we had helped the king, Stephen would support us in return. And that with his help, we would be able to rebuild Kingsbridge Cathedral. Mm -hmm. Винчестерский двор. Перси Хэмли. Бишоп Уэйлорен. Good morning. Али. It's them. Over there. The Хэмлиз. Again, thank you for your assistance in Kingsbridge, my son. We have to thank you. Without you, we wouldn't be here today. Right, Mother? Of course. Well, don't just stand there. Walk out with me, but very calmly. We can't let them see us. Oh, children, pardon me. Hmm. 
Now we're only missing one more. Here he is. Good morning. Bishop Henry, this is my prior, Philip of Gwyneth, prior of Kingsbridge, my mm -hmm. lord bishop. You won't have to say much today, Philip. Leave the talking to us. No, leave the talking to me. King Stephen is my brother, after all. Let us make haste. My brother is an early riser. Глава шесть. Хамлеи. Стефан Hamley did not do it without help, my lord. It was I who told him of the plot against him. Now you come to be rewarded as well. I see. My brother, the Cathedral of Kingsbridge has burnt down. Uh -huh. Waylon asks for a reward, not for himself. He asks for our church. I take it your church cannot afford to rebuild that cathedral, Henry. Neither can the crown. I, or rather Bishop Whaleran, had an idea. You could give the Earl of Shiring's lands to the Bishop of Kingsbridge to finance the rebuilding of the cathedral. I like the idea. <laughs> but Percy and his men were the ones who took out his castle. Not Bishop Wagner. Right, Percy? Oh, yes, my king. He knows the area. And he will be a loyal earl. Of course, my king. We want to give thanks to God first. God made you king. Don't go on like that, Henry. Don't do that. You know what happens when you do that. <laughs> My Lord King, I thank you for being willing to reconsider the future of the Shiring Earldom. When shall we hear your decision? Tomorrow. <laughs> Bring my bow. Tell the men we hunt. Philip, Waylon and I have much to discuss. All right. But what can I do to help? Well, my brother asked me to get a confession from the traitor Bartholomew. A confession would be helpful against those who believe Bartholomew's arrest was unjust. And it may help us to convince my brother to forget all about his promise to Percy Hamlin. Так, епископ Генри считает, что признание Бартоломе может нам помочь. Окей. Заставить графа осознаться. Так. Ну, автосохранение, в принципе, было. Вот. Так что... Я сейчас сделаю... Маленькую... Паузу. Ребятушки. Вот. И мы, в принципе, вернемся.
Ну что ж, ребят, мы продолжаем проходить э, игру. Паузу мы сделали. Перси Хэмли will have the Oldham of Shire, but would he make a good Earl? Who cares? Stephen wanted the throne for twenty years. Now that he has it, he must be loyal to those who are loyal to him. Who knows? Maybe Percy will make a good Earl. From what I've heard, Lady Hamley pulls the string. <laughs> How could you let her get away? That little bitch. I will find her mother. She was here? Why? To see her father, of course. But that won't help her. She has already made a fool of you once. Don't let it happen again. No, mother. What is happening? Reagan Hamley. We have not been formally introduced. You are a fool. Is that formal enough for you, monk? You don't understand any of this, do you? It's as if you've you never set a single father. foot. How you let yourself be used by those two greedy bishops, I'll never know. <sighs> Waleran wants the lands of the Earldom for himself. Henry knows that. Say something. Why would Waleran bring me there? To plead his case. If Stephen had not believed him, Waleran would have sent you forward. I know you don't trust me, but your bishops are no different I from me. I don't believe you. Of course you don't, you fool. Ride with my son. Huh. Just a few hours. I will prove to you that Waleran will betray you. All right. I will ride with your son, if only to prove you wrong. Very well. Maybe you're not a fool, after all. But do not let the bishop see you. William? What? Ride with Father Philip. Do as I said. Uh-huh. William Hamley declined to tell me where we were heading. He enjoyed keeping me in the dark and forcing me to follow his lead. Sometimes he sped ahead on his war horse and it took me some effort to catch up. But sooner or later he would stop and wait, sneering as I enjoyed him. Mm -hmm. On one occasion, he stood there urinating against a rock. When I caught up with him, he turned without covering himself. He found my shock at his shameful behavior comical. He laughed, got back into the saddle, spurred his horse and rode off. Again, I followed, hoping this journey had not been another horrible mistake. Huh. William with a group of washerwomen. He was shouting at them. When I arrived, I could only hear their replies. They said that they had not seen a girl or a boy fitting his description. Oh. A younger, blonde woman Walker. said that even if she had seen the girl, she would not tell him. Apparently, she had heard of William Hamley. William grabbed the startled-looking woman by the arm. He shoved his right hand under her skirt. She started crying. 
The other women asked William to stop, but were afraid to anger him. William turned and screamed when he saw me approaching. Rest. When he heard my words, William's grin faded. He pushed the young woman away. The other women looked at me in strange pain. They must have asked themselves why a monk would ride with such a man's William. We rode off, and William stared at me full of spite. Mm -hmm. I told him I pitied him. I did not tell him why, because I had no words for it. We did not talk after that. No. Not for a long time. Так. Остановка. William talked to more strangers along the way. First, I believed he was asking for directions. Then I realized that money was changing hands. William was paying these people for information. I was glad that for now he had lost interest in hurting others. Then I saw an old woman pointing William to a bearded man on a horse. William called the man a horse thief. Then he grinned and signaled the puzzled man to get on his horse and ride with him. They rode faster and faster, and I could not hear what more they talked about. Так. Подъехать поближе. William bluntly threatened to have the man hanged for stealing a horse of his, and then ordered him to hunt down the real thieves in exchange for his life. The man laughed as if he had made a great bargain. William even paid him. Before the man rode off north, William mentioned a name. Aliena. And I prayed that whatever William's plan was, I should engage fail. Then William waved at me to ride faster. I reckoned we had to be close to where Lady Hamley wanted us to go. Not long after, my stomach turned as I realized just where exactly we were bound. Весело. Так. Дворец епископа. Just a moment. What? You know very well that Bishop Whaleran is in Winchester now. So what are we doing here? No idea. Mother never tells me anything. She treats me and father like damn children. It's a wonder father ever got to fuck her in the first place. But here I am, and I'm starving. Damn, I'm starving. Where are you going? In there. No. I'm sure the bishop would want to see me well fed. We won't be staying long, so whatever it is you've got to do, do it fast. How can I help you? How about you step aside? <laughs> William forgot to close his saddlebag. Так, изучить. Они 
где там тропа. Подожди. Ну... Но... Так, погнали. Сюда, сюда и точнее. before weren't you yes i remember you philip isn't it yes please you have to help me I what happened he forced me to serve him food he took the lord's name in vain and he pushed me and touched me boy call you so what did he ask you for help he didn't have to say anything I knew you would get us in trouble trouble me we're young men he and I and I play rough so what I asked you to leave and that is what we will do what will the bishop think of your behavior listen we're all on the same side here we are not You, me, him, we're all working for the bishop. He won't mind. I play rough, so what? <sighs> we are all men of God. You are a sinner. So what? Everyone is. The bishop told me. But my sins are forgiven. Why would you think that? I took Earl's castle for him. Your parents agreed to arrest Bartholomew because they wanted his earldom. Who cares what they think? I felled Bartholomew's men with my sword. The old man was begging me for his life. On his knees, he begged me. I did it for the bishop. But hey, I'm sure you did great things for him as well. <laughs> you think my father took Earl's car? Pity. Again? You dare to say that again? You pity me. I pity you. You're not a man. Neither of you are. We are men of God. A man kills, and a man fucks. And no one talks down to me. No one! I know you saw me in that hall at the river. I would have fucked that woman if it hadn't been for you. And what would that have achieved? She'd have learned her lesson. And don't you think I noticed how you spied on me and that horse thief? I should kill you for that. I should. Let me tell you. I will fuck Bartholomew's whore of a daughter. I will fuck her good. <laughs> I'm a man. Damn it, I'd fuck the boys. That was the only way to put him in this place. Hell, he 
he looks like he'd enjoy it. Not even God would forgive those sins. Of course he would. He already did. The bishop told me. Then the bishop is wrong. <gasps> hey, we're on the same side here. Now, we will stay here a while longer, as I've not finished eating. Shit. Так. Ага. Так, сейчас сохранимся. Здесь что ли сохранится? Почему бы нет? Bishop finds out about this, he will not be pleased. I have to fix this. Throw them into the blazing furnace, where there will be weeping and gnashing of teeth. What? Hell. It is a depiction of hell. I told you of heaven and hell once before. You remember? Of course. The bishop said the relief intimidates even his most impious visitors. They all fear death. I'm not afraid of that. Do not fear those who kill the body. Rather fear him who can destroy both soul and body in hell. Who's he? The devil. A fallen angel. <laughs> I have nothing to be afraid of. The coward, the unbelieving, the vile, the murderers, the sexually immoral, those who practice magic arts, the idolaters of all lives. Their souls are the devils. They will all go to hell. Stop it! Hell is far away. I'm not afraid. Так что там? Кубок, нож и тарелка. Кубок, нож и тарелка. Ну да. Так. And if anyone's name was not found written in the book of life, he was thrown into the lake of fire. What's that? It's from the scripture. The end of days. The second death. The sinners. Bishop Whaleran said that if a sinner stares into the flame, the devil stares back from the lake of fire. What? Hmm. I can't see it. We ride back to Winchester. Now! Чувак, штанишки нагавил. Пом-пом-пом-пом-пом-пом. What happened? Maybe he saw things to come. How can I thank you? 
Так. It's for you to question him either. That man, William, had no idea why you two came here, had he? You came here to spy on the bishop. You brought this man here. I... Leave! Go! But leave the table where? I only wanted to tidy up the table. Of course. I knew you couldn't be trusted ever since I saw you stealing apples and hay when you first came here. My son seemed thoughtful when he returned. You priests and your talk, you'll always get to him. He seemed more excited after talking to your bishop, though. Then again, we know Waleran is good with words. Don't we, my husband? Of course, yes. Speaking of Waleran, what did you find, monk? I... I'm not sure. You must have seen it. Are you that blind? Bishop Whaler and by God is building a castle, and he used up every stone and every tree on his own lands. He claims he wants Bartholomew's land for your cathedral. But what Whaler wants is a castle. He's always been like that. Not long ago, you doubted my word. Do you still doubt me now, Father? What do you want from me? As Prior of Kingsbridge, you will agree that my husband shall have the whole earldom of Shire. And why would I do you a favor like that? Because we will support mm. the rebuilding of your cathedral with our stones and our timber. The king can live up to all of his promises. Whaler and gets nothing. That is our offer. What do you say? Mm -hmm. No, we have no deal. Why not? We made you a good offer. You need me. The king still considers giving all the lands of the earldom to Whaler and to rebuild our cathedral. You need this deal with me just as much as I do. This is... Ugh. We taught this fool well, it seems. What are your terms, Father? <laughs> what is more valuable, arable land or forest? Arable land, of course. Then you shall have the arable and I'll have the forest. I need the forest to hunt. An earl must have his hunting grounds. You can hunt there. I just want the timber for my cathedral. Ugh. Which do you want? The cattle pastures or the sheep grazing? The pasture. Then I'll have the hill farms with their sheep. Would you like the income from markets or the quarry? Suppose we said the quarry. You won't though, will you? No. We'll take the markets. You can have the stones. It is agreed then? We have a pact. My husband will let the king know of our agreement. Bishop Whalen will be quite surprised. You will see his true face when he does not get what he wants.
Так, окей. Загрузим то, что достижение там не очень хорошее получили. Так. Вот это получается, да? Так. Ага, спросить. Ну да, это мы знаем, все. Так, отлично. Значит, мы договорились о том, о чем договорились. Так. Так. Так, подожди.
епископ считает. Так. It's his fourth day without bread. Soon he won't even be Bartholomew anymore. Тюрьма. Bartholomew. I am Brother Philip. Would you forgive those that wronged you? Only God forgives. A monk should know that. Your conspiracy. Was it really worth dying for? Stephen sent you. Why would you side with the usurper? I was asked to make you confess. <coughs> Stronger men tried that before you. Why should I confess to you? <coughs> I am responsible for your arrest. I found a letter you wrote to the Earl of Gloucester, my Bishop Whaler, and showed it to Percy Hammond. Oh. And why? What? Why would your bishop do that? To prevent a war and to help the church. Of course. <laughs> I have no sins to confess. My only regret is that I failed. I will not tell the king that. They will kill you. They have already done that. Monk, tell them that I confessed. To what? All of it. Treason. But... The son shall not suffer for the iniquity of the father. Tell Stephen that as well. You... know the scripture? Richard and Aliena, my children, they must live. Так. Хорошо. And a good day to you too, father. Так, цитадели. Ага. А где епископ? А, вот он. Bartholomew's confession. Maybe you can get him to confess. I do not believe my prior can do more than you could, Henry. Perhaps he knows he will die, no matter what he says. Would you not rather build a castle, my bishop? What? A castle like this. Do you not find this place remarkable? Winchester Castle. Of course, it is. Hmm. Maybe I should come back tomorrow. 
Yes, there is not much a monk can do here. Yes, your bishop and I will do what we can to help your priory. My loyal subject, Percy Hamley, today becomes the Earl of Shari. Of the former Earl's possessions, Percy shall have the castle. And all the land that is tenanted to knights, plus all other arable land and low-lying castles. I swear by all that is holy to be your legion, and to fight for you against any other. Mm -hmm. My king. Ah, yes. Of course, I have not forgotten the worries of my bishops. The Earl of Shiring himself, Percy here, solved this problem for me. Thanks to him, I can uphold my promise. Don't worry, Bishop Waderan. Kingsbridge shall be rebuilt. Percy told me of a man here whom my brother has not yet introduced. Come forward, Fra. My brother, may I present to you Philip of Gwynedd, my king. You seem afraid. What are you worried about? will also have the right to take stone from the Earl's quarry and timber from his forest. I wholeheartedly agree with the plan you two have devised. It shall be done. Thank you. Thank you, my lord. It seems unnecessarily complicated to give the lands to Bishop. Percy told me that you, Father Philip, share that sentiment. He told me it was your idea to take up the burden of managing the rebuilding of the cathedral yourself. I... Wonderful. I'm glad that we all were able to help you, Bishop Wayland, in this pressing matter. Mm -hmm. After all you've done for me. Thank you, Lord King. Bartholomew lost everything in his attempt to end my way. This morning, he was found dead in his cell. I've heard that you, Pra, worry for his children, Richard and Aliena. While they shall lose their status, their name, and their land, they shall go free, wherever they are. You must be very proud, Lady de Hamley. Of course. Father Philip has been very understanding in all this. Yes, he is remarkable. Very remarkable. My husband would tell me when we heard about the father and the It was a You sowed the wind, Philip. пироги с картошкой, да? седьмая
Is everyone ready? Yes, everyone will be there. But how are we to pray and contemplate like this? I don't dare even to send my choir out there. We shall get used to it, all of us. We must be thankful for all of this, for each noise, each face that disturbs us here. We shall start with the chancel and gradually work our way from east to west. That's the way it's done, the way I was taught to do it. I value your enthusiasm, my dear Mason, but so far we're only cleaning up. I haven't even considered hiring a master builder yet, neither you nor anyone else. May I show you some drawings? By all means. Так. А можно сохраниться, народ? Можно, да? Так, сейчас, ребят, мы вернемся. Это уже следующая, по сути, глава. Сейчас. Так, ну что, народ, продолжаем, смотрим. Так. Are those windows? Right, but that's not all. Mm -hmm. On top are the clear story windows. On the lowest level are the pillars of the arcade. They're joined by arches making up the bays. Through the archways you can see the windows in the aisle. Shall I go on? Yes, yes, of course. I was just thinking. Keep going. Mm -hmm. Starting right in the middle is the Tribune Gallery. I can see you've put a lot of thought into this. I was just wondering... How long would this take to build? You can take your time with that answer. Well, that depends on how many people you employ. If you can afford 60 masons, you could build the whole church at once instead of working from east to west. That might take eight years, maybe ten. I wish my monastic officials had your ability to think ahead and calculate. Go on now, show me the rest of your drawing. Dark. When we walk around the site, we mark where the walls will be, the pillars, the doors, and buttresses. Now for that, we need a plan like this, to tell us where to place our pegs and strength. Is this how birds would see our church? Exactly. The nave is on the left, it has six bays. And the chancel. Uh-huh. Here, you can see the transept. I noticed, yes. It is remarkable how much you can reveal with so few lines. Thank you, Father. Mm -hmm. I haven't told you everything about the thing. Is there anything more you want to know? Ah, the chancel well. will have four bags. Hmm. 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 I can see the transept is two bays wide, so it will be twelve in total. 
It does look splendid, but isn't that rather small? It would be smaller, but not less impressive. I guess a small cathedral would be closer to our means. It is still also uncertain. The king grants us timber and stone, and wool from Shiring's pastures. But only God knows if it will be enough. I don't suppose you have any idea how much this would cost. I know exactly how much this would cost. It would be no more than £3,000. I've spent the last few weeks working out the annual income of the Priory. Here's the answer. £300 a year. And we spend every penny. So, I need to find £200 a year. Doesn't sound so bad when you put it that way. You really want to build this cathedral yourself, don't you? Yes, Father. I want you to appoint me Master Builder. Why? <laughs> because he wants to give people hope. Is that so? Then answer me this one last question. If people were to enter your church, what image would they see crowning the tympanum above the entrance? One of judgment day to teach people to be good? Or one of paradise to remind them of God's mercy? Show them how, so that they're afraid to do bad things. Hmm, I'd rather see trees and animals. Но это да. It should be the promise of a better life. Therefore, it will show heaven. Yes. Milius, is there news of my brother? No, uh, unfortunately not. No one has seen or heard from him since the bishop and Percy Hamley were here. Papa, will there be statues inside? Statues? Oh. That's enough, children. It's time you went out and played. Briar. Yes? My first wife, Agnes. She died without a priest, and she's buried in unconsecrated ground. Sometimes a man builds a chapel, or founds a monastery. And I hope that in the afterlife, God will remember his piety. I just wonder, do you think my design might serve to protect Agnes's soul? God no longer asks for blood sacrifices, for the ultimate sacrifice has already been made. But the lesson of Abraham's story is that God demands the best we have to offer. That which is most precious to us. So you must ask yourself, is this design the best thing you could offer? Except for my children. Yes. And then rest easy, Tom Builder. God will accept it. Okay. Так. <coughs> Jack, do me a favor and give Paul these herbs, will you? But he 
he's a monk. You don't like monks. Well, it turns out not all of them are bad. <laughs> Still, be careful before you trust any one of them. Well, your son already trusted me. Oh, yes. I know that the Builder is not his father, and I also know about you. It won't be long till they throw you out of Kingsbridge. Which... There he is! Give her prior the welcome he deserves! Oh, um, you know, I am only following God's will. Prepare to raise the bell! Make the prior proud! <laughs> well, um, thank you. Go on, Jack. Don't forget about Paul's herbs. Mm -hmm. А где Пол? Альфред. Подожди. Tom asked me to. We see eye to eye now, you know. He asked me things, and I can say yes or no. Huh. Hey, did you tell him that I had trouble with him? You bastard. I told you not to. I have to carve up some steaks later. If you want, you can help me. Or you can do whatever the hell it is you're doing all day. It's your call. Так. Угу. Так. А. Вот брат Пол. Текс. Погнали. This is from my mother. Oh, bless her. Boy, whatever Remedia says, your mother is a saint. Oh. Is that the bell? Can you see it from here? A bell without a cathedral. Your father certainly has strange ideas. <laughs> it might be. What's a bell? Excuse me. You. I remember you. You're the boy with no father. Actually, I have two fathers now. Is that so? Yes. Tom Builder and Jack Sherberg. I thought you weren't the Builder's son. Well, I am now. I have to say... Uh, Philip told me there would be a lot of sheep here. I can see he wasn't exaggerating. You know Philip too? I do. He's the reason I'm here. Is he around? He should be around somewhere. Busy man, that fellow. But don't worry. You probably won't have to look for him for long. All right. Thank you.
Shall we go after them? No. Now we know where we can find them. Ha! Ho! Oh! Send him in, Timothy. We have much to discuss. Офигеть! Ни хрена себе поворотики. Я б сказал. Next time on the Pillars of the Earth, find out what happened to me and my, my brother Richard after the siege of our father's castle. What will the future hold in store for Kingsbridge? The Pillars of the Earth, sowing the wind. Офигеть. Ребят, я после титров скажу впечатление об игре. Пока что без комментариев я отойду и сделаю предысторию, точнее впечатление об игре. В общем, ребят, я хочу сказать, что да и далек, они молодцы. Они делают не просто квесты, да, они делают квесты, которые похожи на телтеловские игры. Вот. Так что... У меня положительные впечатления об игре. Я с удовольствием прошел первую книгу. Она проходится довольно прилично. Может часов за 6, за 7. Ну, ну потому что в книге еще под главы. У меня впечатление об игре, как знаете, игра престолов и впечатление об игре. А душевненько, интересненько. У меня такие впечатления были от телтеловских игр наподобие ходячих мертвецов. Так что да и далек прыгнули выше себя. То есть я теперь понимаю, почему эта игра а, как сказать эту компанию восхвалила, потому что это действительно у них очень сильный проект. Так что да и далек молодцы. Если они будут делать подобно игры, как Столпы Земли, и пытаться делать что-то реально душевно, у них иг игра, это именно вот эта игра, она приближена к, к фильму. То есть у тебя реально офигенные впечатления, и... От первой книги, после конца первой книги, их три всего, у тебя такой, типа, вау-эффект. Блин, это круто. Это реально круто, и... Блин, вот именно вот эта игра и показывает, что игры это, ребят, искусство. Так что, в принципе, спасибо, что смотрели, ставили лайки. Всем всего хорошего, всем до новых встреч. Увидимся во второй книге.
А с вами был Казуку Фэмили. Всем всего до скорого, всем удачи и всем пока-пока.